Who am I? What is my purpose? What is the purpose of life in general? These are questions that everybody asks and for good reason. We don't come to this world with instruction manuals and we all struggle to kind of figure out why we're here, who we are. But it seems like society has us asking that question, chasing our tails with the, who am I? What am I supposed to do? Where am I supposed to be? And there's some special people in the world that have kind of figured that out. And as I've gotten older, uh, been on this planet 40 plus years, and I've learned that the right question to ask is, who do I want to be? Instead of asking who am I and what my purpose is, it's taking that question out of fate's hands and taking control of it and saying, who do I want to be? I'm the one in charge. I'm the one that's going to create the life that I want. Um, even with poor, bad, horrible circumstances, people can still make choices and can still live the life that they dream of. It takes a lot of work and takes some help. But there's a man by the name of John Goddard, and he died, I think it was late 80s, or he was in his late 80s, rather. Um, and Goddard, when he was 15 years old, came up with this idea of making what he called my life list. And over the course of time, he created 127 different uh, goals or dreams or, or things he wanted to do, be, see, or accomplish, or just experience in general. And when he died in his late 80s, he had accomplished 114 of those 127. So, <clears throat> pardon me, pretty impressive, pretty impressive. Um, on there were some crazy goals like um, run a five minute mile, um, land an airplane on an aircraft carrier, milk a poisonous snake, but he also had some more common goals. Uh, he wanted to do a lot of traveling and, and some pretty wild travel included, but you know, he, he wanted to get out. He wanted to travel. He wanted to see and experience as many things as possible, but he also wanted to raise a family. He wanted to have kids and a wife and, and enjoy that as well. So he, with his life, asked himself, who do I want to be? Instead of asking what's my purpose or what's the purpose of life or who am I, he asked the question, who do I want to be? And then he wrote it down on a list, very specific, and he upgraded and improved that list as time went on and ultimately was able to accomplish those things because they were before him. They were sitting there like in his face, right there, like this is what I want to do with my life. And I think that's the question we all need to ask ourselves. We need to ask ourselves not who am I or what's the purpose of life? Because I think someone like Goddard has kind of explained what the purpose of life is. We don't come here with instruction manuals. So the purpose of life is to create, to be creative and to do something with your life that sings to you, that feels good to you, like Goddard did. And the question to ask and to try to answer is, who do I wanna be? So I ask you, what are some things that you wanna see, do, be, uh, experience? What are some things that are on your list? Do you have a list? If you don't, why not make a list? Why not, right? Well, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I ask you to comment below about who do you want to be?